Hi, my name is Melanie Shelley with Trim Classic Barber and Legendary Beauty. And today we're going to talk about how to create a daytime eye. The tools you'll need for a successful eyeshadow application are a large fluff brush with a bevel, a small fluff brush, again with a bevel, a fluffy detailing brush with a point on the tip, and a flat application brush. You'll also need an eyelash curler. In this one I'm using an individual eyelash curler for more control, clean professional makeup sponges, a concealer palette, and palettes of professional eyeshadow or actually over-the-counter eyeshadow and we'll be talking about what colors to use next. First we use the yellow base shadow to highlight the lid of the eye. Second, we created a very light shadow with a taupe in a half moon over the eyelid. Third, we highlighted the brow bone with a very light vanilla shadow. Now, take a large eyeshadow fluff brush and blend it out softly so there's no lines of demarcation. Now, we're highlighting under the lash line with a yellow powder to get rid of any redness and to make the eye appear brighter. Next, take a shimmery peach shadow and sweep it across the top of the lid. Make sure that you don't reach up and over into your shading. And make sure only to apply where the eye curves around the socket. Next, to create some drama that won't scare your coworkers, press a small fluff brush with a taupe shadow into the corner of the eye. Gently wiggle it into the skin and with the clean side of your brush sweep your peach that you put in across to blend. As you're working make sure to buff away any lines with a makeup sponge so that the eye looks clean and fresh and doesn't look like nighttime makeup. It's important that when you create daytime eyeliner that it be nearly imperceptible, but what you want it to do is really make your lash line pop. So what you need is a cream liner and a very tight, small angle brush that lays very, very flat. Dip the brush on both sides into the liner pot. Get the excess off of the brush, and it's okay to use the back of your hand because I know you'll be washing it next. Gently lay the angle brush into the eye, pressing against the skin right next to the lash. Repeat and repeat until you get to the end of the lash line. Don't give in to the temptation to make a thick line or to rub it because what you want is something that creates a line that only looks like it's your real lashes. Now, you want to curl the lashes. You want the eyes to look bright and open. So you're going to use an individual lash curler or you can use a regular lash curler available at most pharmacies. I like the individual lash curler because you have more control and it gives a nice strong curl. This is how you do it. Place the lash curler, squeeze the bottom up to the top and pinch gently three times. Each time, you can let the lash go a little bit farther until you walk it out and create a nice curl. Next, we're gonna apply mascara. To finish your mascara look, you're gonna to wanna to do your lower lashes. It just gives that extra little pop. Then, finish with a lash comb to make sure that you don't have any spidery clumps. I'm Melanie Shelley, and today I showed you how to create a beautiful daytime look.